It's a graceful element of Māori culture, but it seems performing with poi could also be good for you. Clinical trials involving a group of retirees in Auckland showed a number of health benefits. Māori Affairs reporter Yvonne Tahana got right into the swing of it. The Pātea Māori Club's celebration of poi made this number one hit a Kiwi icon. But there's so much more to the art form, says the circus performer turned researcher. Poi did something magical to me that I can't quite explain, but it wasn't just physical, um, it was definitely cognitive as well. Her love of poi led her to ask whether there could be health benefits. She thought the elderly could gain from its free-flowing movements, so she set up a trial. Everything seems to collapse once you get over 60, so um, it, it it was quite, quite nice to, to do something that was positive for your health. When any poi come out, I'm hiding. Let's be honest, this is as good as it gets. But for over 80, 60-year-olds who took part in a month-long program, many of them progressed from simple spinning to figure eights to even more complex butterfly moves. The poi was slightly modified for participants. Instead of soft, fluffy material as the weight, rice was used. Still, the group showed significant improvement in grip strength balance and memory. It's really exciting because those things sort of cover a lot of the hallmarks of frailty and are really important when thinking about maintaining and improving quality of life in older age. 68-year-old <laughs> Marlene Stratton says her upper body strength's improved and... Of course, as you age, you tend to get wings. Um, and I think it's, it's firmed, firmed up my, um, my wings. An unexpected bonus that could see Poi find some new fans on a wider stage. Yvonne Tahana, One News.